It's one of our favorite herd of elephants. There's the cow there with her two-thirds of trunk left and her little baby, her earlier baby there, just closest to us, tossing bits and pieces of tree around. And then I think off to the right-hand side there, a sibling. Could be her first calf, but it just looks a little bit too old for me. We've been sat here for a little while now. We did a little Facebook Live of them, and we've been doing these Facebook Live things for a couple of weeks, well, about a week now. And they're just little trailers to try and drive people towards the main channel where we are now watching. And if there are any Facebook Livers around and have joined us on the main channel, hashtag Safari Live is how you can ask us questions on Twitter. Otherwise, questions at wildearth.tv is how you can email us and it'd be good to hear from you. And remember, tell us where you're from. We had a wonderful, wonderful um, question yesterday, all the way from Romania. I think it was Crad was his name. I might be incorrect, but I think that's what it was. Now, these elephants are decimating these Combretum trees. I think uh, that actually, yeah, it looks like a red bush willow that is being devoured there by that one. Sibling to the matriarch, I think. And then off to the left-hand side, the matriarch breaking off other bits and pieces. And they've been digging here for some time. Digging at the roots. Because that's, of course, is where a plant, especially in the winter... <laughs> that is where an elephant, is, or at least a plant, especially in the winter months, will um, store the carbohydrates and nutrients for when it wants to go for the springtime for when it wants to flush its new leaves so if you can get at the roots quite a rich source of nutrients and you know that of course from anybody who's eaten a carrot they really are doing quite a number on these trees and you can also see they're covered in mud I think they found a pan somewhere on one of the roads we're quite close to hyena road where there are a few pans so I suspect they've come up from there tossed mud all over themselves on this hot day, 27 or so degrees Celsius, 79 Fahrenheit. And because it's a little bit warm, nice to have a cooling mud bath. Do you have a mud bath today, Viam? No, I'm going to have mine later. You're going to have yours later. Okay, good idea. Now that's root, everybody. That root has been extricated, that huge long piece of plant has been extricated from the ground, pulled out. I promise you now, with your bare hands, you would not be able to pull that out. Now watch, this is how the elephants do it. See the tusks into the ground? This is fantastic. Look at that. Look. That is brilliant. I've never seen that before. I might be forced to take my camera out here.